so, <laughs> so we did one. It's written for one mezzo soprano, one and a half mannequins, and a tape machine. So, <laughs> <laughs> get a cast, sort of, and sort of get together. You opera lovers, like it's a, well, like a ballad opera, which was like in the old days. Uh, in the old days, people used to, um, there was something called a ballad opera, which was a type of opera that was more about ordinary life, not necessarily about, like, um, bullfighters or what have you. And they also, like, would borrow already existing tunes. And so, for this, the musical structure of this opera is, we've got an original um, overture written and performed by Matthew Nail. I'm setting up his witchcraft now. Um, and we've got, um, there's two arias, and um, the tunes to the arias um, were very kindly donated by a... W Mozart and, uh, and Bizet. It's about modern dentistry. It's about particularly inspired by a practice called gaming. Everyone's actually entitled in this country to NHS dental care. Most dentists are private, they just do private patients. I'll do a mixture of private and NHS patients. And so there's this practice called gaming, which is where they try and get as many of their NHS pa patients to take up the course of private care as much as possible, and there's various ways to do it. I think this is something that's <clears throat> something that you're start, starting to see coming in now with um, GPs as well, trying to introduce sort of internal back system for GPs, and even in um, even outside the NHS and other various areas areas of government, what should be public service is made increasingly complicated because something like taxing people fairly and then using the money to provide public service is something that's becoming like a big taboo. So they're trying to get around. Anyway, what you're about to see is will probably bear no resemblance to any of that. <laughs> <laughs>
Thank <laughs> you. 